for row three, we're going to chain three for the turning chain again. And then we're going to add three double crochet into that very first stitch. So even though these are our first three double crochet, we have a total of four stitches for this row because the turning chain counts as the first stitch. So this is two and three. Next, we're going to single crochet on top of the single crochet right here. And then we are going to add a shell stitch, which is seven double crochet into the center of the V stitch right here. And that's going to be our repeat for this row. So we're going to add shell stitches into the center of each V and we're going to add a single crochet on top of each single crochet. And at the end of the row, we're going to finish with four double crochet into the last stitch. Now I am going to have the rest of the row here for you to watch, but make sure that you add your four double crochet into the top of the turning chain. If you enjoy these close-up stitch tutorials, be sure to like and follow. And that's it for row three, and I will see you in row four.